Hello and welcome to the Out of the Sandbox video guide to the Turbo Shopify theme featured promotions section. Today we're going to take a look at the featured promotion section and the settings associated with it. Here I am in the customize settings editor and I'm just going to scroll down on the home page a little bit here to see this row of featured promotions appearing with some animation styles as it loads up. But in case you don't have a featured promotions section already as part of your layout, Here's how you add one. You go ahead to Add Section, Locate Featured Promotions, and add it to the layout. And of course, just like any of the other sections in this sequence of sections here, you can click and drag to move it around within the sequence. I'm going to remove this example section here and then scroll on back up to the default section and take a look at the settings associated with it. To do that, we'll go ahead and click on the Featured Promotions section here to open up these settings. So the settings up here pertain to the entire section, whereas the settings associated with each one of the features, each one of those content blocks can be viewed here as we expand that content block. Great. Let's take a look at this first setting here, promotions per row, which can go between two and four. Looking good, and of course we can add more features to fill out the layout by clicking Add Promotion here. There we've got six featured promotions appearing now in a three per row layout. I'm just going to remove those last two that I added as an example here so that we can go ahead and start to configure a four per row layout of featured promotions. The next setting here that applies to the entire section is this wide display setting, which will allow the features to span the entire width of the layout. As opposed to having that setting disabled where the featured promotions appear sort of within the layout of the theme. Great, we've got the promotion animations. Of course, none is an option if you would like for those promotions to simply appear. We also have fade in, which appears like this fade up, and of course this default fade down. Looking good. And those animations will take place as the user scrolls to that area of the page, as opposed to it happening right on page load, in case those featured promotions are out of view, and then as the user scrolls down they will animate into position. We have a few options for promotion styles to add some flexibility to this section. We can have them appear as circles, as squares, or as squares with rounded corners, as you see here. With these featured promotions, the title is appearing on the promotion itself. However, you can have the title appear below the featured promotion, as you see here. Great, let's have those titles appear right on top of the featured promotion, and then take a look at the settings associated with each one of the featured promotions. To do that, we expand the settings here, and of course, our first setting that we can configure is the image. I'll go ahead and Choose an example image here. Great. Of course, these featured promotions should probably link somewhere. To do that, you can select from any of your pages, blog posts, products, and collections on the Shopify platform, or go ahead and input a different link. This is where we can input the title that appears on the featured promotion. And then we've got this text setting. Now you can't see the text right now because the text appears as we hover over the featured promotion, along with that underline style appearing. So of course this is where you can edit the text. Fantastic. All right, scrolling down from there we've got one last setting that applies to each one of the featured promotions individually, and that is the button label. I'll just add some text here to show you what that button looks like, and here it is as we hover over the featured promotion. And of course, clicking on the button or anywhere in the featured promotion will lead to the link that you have set up in this link setting. The settings for the other featured promotions are all exactly the same, so each one of these featured promotions is configured the same way. So let's take a look at how we have used this feature on some of our demo shops so that you can see how flexible it is and hopefully give you ideas of how you can configure your featured promotion section on your own site. First here is our Portland demo where we have a four per row layout. It is set to the wide display. 
Some of the featured promotions have a button, some do not, and they all lead to different places around the site, the About Us page, whether you've got a special collection of sale items, or to the blog. Great! Here in our Florence demo, we have prominently featured the Featured Promotion section in the spot where you would usually see a banner image. Instead, we've got two Featured Promotions appearing with the Wide Display setting enabled, with button text, with some additional information text as well to give you this effect. In our Dubai demo here, we've got two per row appearing with the Wide Display setting disabled, and no additional text appearing, just the underline style to give some style to these links. In our sole demo here, we've got a two per row setup. We've got the wide display setting disabled. We've got the title appearing below the featured promotion, and then with a significant amount of text and a button appearing on hover, as you see here. Finally, with our Chicago demo, we've got three featured promotions appearing in a row with the wide display feature enabled. We've got the button appearing with some text appearing as well, and these all leading to various collections or blogs uh, throughout the site. So that's how you go about configuring your featured promotions. Don't forget any of these content blocks. You can click and drag them among the other content blocks to reposition that featured promotion in the order that they appear. Hopefully this gives you some ideas of how you can configure a compelling featured promotion section on your homepage. My name's Sean Campbell. Thank you for joining me for this video guide. Take care.